That was very hard to say without Channel 4 solicitors snapping their pencils and chucking the dolly out the pram. Anyway, it's time now for my next guest. She's been described as a cross between Lucille Ball and Freddie Mercury. She loves getting dressed up, she enjoys a drink, and she believes her makeup, and this is very important, ladies, she believes her makeup should always be two degrees away from a drag queen's, <laughs> really. She's Pop's most talked about new star. A <laughs> new album is called One of the Boys. Will you please welcome the very individual, Miss Katy Perry. Let me hear you. Come on. <laughs> Oh, sweetheart, sit down. Today Kate. it's just one degree away from a drag queen. No, it's very subtle today, Casey. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. Painted on, thick, yes. <laughs> no, it's not. It's very, very snow white today. Thank Pale you. skin, dark hair, little bit of red lipstick. Thank you. I love the shoes. Thank I, you. They're fantastic. 1940s <laughs> gangsters mall. Yeah. They are. And the skirt and the mac and the berry. It's wonderful. It's film noir. You look Fabulous. Thank absolutely you. fabulous. Amazing. No, amazing. I mean that. Really, I mean it. I absolutely mean it. I love individuals and I love somebody with style and you've got it in bucket loads. Stop it! No, you have. You re okay. No, come on. Get okay. Listen, let, let, go get now. You love us. How did you get on in Liverpool? Oh, man. Your hometown. Yeah, my... Well, I'm the other side of the walls at Birkenhead. Oh. Okay. It's a little fishing village. Very, very <laughs> quiet. But Liverpool was my stomping ground. That's it's where very nice. The people are very nice. Yeah. I, I went out one evening. I went to this place called Pink's and I know accosted by a couple of queens themselves. And, <laughs> and it was very fun. And, you know, it's nice just to walk into a place and they go, What are you doing here? That's <laughs> Cockney. <Stop> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it was very nice, and of course the EMAs were amazing. Yeah. I mean, I'm only a few months into my career, and they give me so much responsibility. <sighs> how, how, did you enjoy hosting it? Were you nervous? I did. You know, I was nervous in the very beginning, but after, you know, uh, coming f up from the stage, riding a huge chapstick, I thought, I can't... I can't be nervous anymore. Yeah. I mean, how could you be bothered to tell me to come on on a chapstick? Yeah. Have you ever done that? <laughs> What, do you know what a chapstick is? <laughs> For your lips, you know, but this was a huge one. I've always had the most kissable lips. Oh, I've yeah. never... <laughs> do you know what it is, Casey? When you look at this, this is pure burlesque to me. It really oh, yeah. is. It really is. With the cherries and the chapstick and it's, the costumes. It's, and... A bit, it's a bit slapstick for me, and it's definitely very innocent, of course. Yeah, of course, you know. like everything. Cherries and bananas are just fruit. Yeah, yes, exactly. Right. <laughs> yes, and then... There are fruits of a different kind. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Carmen Miranda, look what she did with a bunch oh, of cherries. She, I and mean... A, you know, fabulous. Yeah. I loved your Minnie Mouse with the big bow. I love that outfit. Oh, thank you. I love that. Have you got a picture, Bess? <laughs> yeah, yeah, up there. That's <laughs> fabulous. <laughs> that is just... That's a burlesque queen. That's Aww. Minsky's on the yeah. runway at midnight. It really is as well. How many costume changes did you have in all? Um, I had, well, if you're counting arrivals and departures... Yes, that's very important. 13, then. Yeah. Of course, yeah. I had 13. But on the actual show, I had, I think I had like 11 or 12. I can't remember, because it was so fast. Literally, some of the time, I was... I had two minutes in between to change into one, and then I had five minutes, and, you know, there was all kinds of chaos. I was running in slippers across an arena, and my stylist friend was zipping my back up, and I'd have my skin in the zipper. In the zip. oh. And he'd have, he, like, ripped a nail off, hook and eyeing me, and it was just like, oh, my gosh, it's a war out there. <laughs> it is, it, it is. really is a war. Do you know what I love? <laughs> this time last year, Katie, she was watching the awards on TV at home, weren't you? Yeah, um, uh, I was sitting in my bed, of course, no makeup on, no degrees away from a drag queen and <laughs> it, with my robe i love my robe and <laughs> you know eat mac and cheese like you guys have mac macaroni and cheese, and cheese is macaroni that? and cheese yeah. just in my bed eating the emas thinking i hope one day i'll get to go i hope one day i'll get to go <gasps> boom you're the host holy crap <laughs> <laughs> what did you think I mean, I thought they dialed the wrong number. I was like, are you sure? Are you in a desperate situation? And is my number a hotline? Are you calling for a crisis? <laughs> and the award. Congratulations. Thank Big you. Big congratulations. Yeah. Thank in you. fact, you're having a ball, aren't you, at the moment? Of course I am. Of course am. you are. If I wasn't having a ball, I wouldn't be doing this. Yeah, yeah. And when I don't have a ball, I will probably stop. You'll stop. Do something yes, else. Yeah. I'll stop. Yeah. I've been threatening it for years. <laughs> 
Do you know what? There's a movie out, and it's it's an old movie. It's about it's about New York in the 80s, and it's called Paris After Dark. Paris is burning. Paris yeah. is burning. Why do I call it Paris After Dark? I because call it, it was that. probably after dark yeah, in your time. When yes. I saw it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it in the cinema, you know, in New York. Yeah. And I remember being, I, I come out and I thought, I'm obsessed with this film, Paris oh. is Burning, and it's all about voguing. You know what Madonna did? But what an inspire? Did it inspire you this documentary when you saw it? Well, I, I'm a. I love big personality, yeah. of course, and I'm inspired by that. And when you mentioned the Lucia Ball, when you mentioned the Freddie Mercury, yeah. to, to me, those people are huge personalities. Yeah. Those people, you know, you will kind of reference for a long time yeah. in life. And uh, that movement was such a specific, different, you know, nobody fell asleep watching that movie. Tell it, man, nobody dared to fall asleep. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it was brilliant. No. And there's so many quotes out of there. Oh, my goodness. Oh, God. I could, there's a few I've got, but I can't say them at tea time. I know. That, that's the thing. <laughs> Listen, congratulations on the new single. Thank I you, I mean, what kindly. is it? It's number seven already. Can I ask you a personal question? Is oh. there a man in your life who's getting you hot and cold? Oh, there is now. Oh, Teddy, you haven't lost it, Teddy. You really haven't lost it. What is it. this strange power I have? You have this magnetism over beautiful women. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you are. Look, you've got to go in. Look, I'm sorry. Thank you. Sorry, I didn't mean it. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Look, Charlie, you broke his heart now, Casey. That's better. <laughs> <laughs> But it's, uh, I hope that I it's... am very hot and cold with you. I am. I'm so sorry about that. That's okay. That's I don't okay. know what I want in life. Maybe I'll grow it's up. It's the story and... of my life as a young man. <laughs> <laughs> they sit it close true, and though? then they'd get away. <laughs> oh. Well, isn't what true? That sometimes you know relationships can be very hot and cold. Yeah. You put one <laughs> foot in, you put one foot out. Well, I've only been married 43 years. 43 times. Yeah. <laughs> You must have a nice lawyer. <laughs> He's also destitute, Katie. I have the 43 managers. It hasn't been easy. <laughs> Teddy Wogan, you old fly. I never knew. 43 years. 43 wives. In 43 years, that's one a year. <laughs> what does well, Lady Wogan well, say about this? Well, as I said, it hasn't been easy. <laughs> The poor woman, she must be distraught. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be in the papers tomorrow. Teddy Wogan's had fun. One of the boys, what a great title. Are you one of the boys? Do you feel like one of the boys? Well, I definitely like to see the expression on a guy's face when they realise, huh, she can do it too. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. nice. I mean, uh, I think it's uh, nice to be presentable as a lady. and. Yes. Um, but it's even nicer when you can uh, beat them at their own game. Yeah. Now look, in here I've noticed <laughs> Teddy's got very worried. Yet. No, she's right though, Teddy. This is the modern woman you're dealing with now. Believe you me. I wouldn't know what to do with a modern woman. Oh. <laughs> I'd never know what to do with an old woman. <laughs> I've never known what to do with any of them, Teddy. The <laughs> there go. Look. And when old Mother Riley died, something, <laughs> something died in your life. Sally, that was, a, that was the end of me. I'm hanging around the hall all the time. <laughs> There's a lot of heartbreak songs in here, Katie, I noticed. Hmm? Have you suffered, for one so young and beautiful, have you suffered heartbreak? Have you? Come on, tell your Uncle Paul. Uh. You confess. Come on, come on, tell me. Tell all. I'll... Well, listen, of course. Yeah, we I love. mean, even if it's your first love, you remember your first love and it was very... Intense, you know, your first love is very intense. You want to marry him and you think he's it. And if you break up, there's not going to be another one. And I feel that this is probably the conversation that parents are having with their kids these days. Please don't marry that one. I, I, there is another one, <laughs> yeah. please. And I was kind of that girl who, you know, I've always, I always love to the fullest. Oh. I do everything pretty much to the fullest, I've as you can this. tell. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. Uh, that goes along with love. It's, it's not, you know, I'm not one of those girls that likes to really just date around yeah. or yeah. sleep around yeah. or even kiss around. Yeah, of course not. What a shame. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what am I doing here? Making a show of me, Teddy. That's what you're doing. <laughs> Casey, the album's brilliant. I think you're a remarkable young woman. I really well do. Done. And I'm Absolutely. delighted for your success. I Thank really you. am. And long may you reign, flower. Yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, please, let's Thank hear you. it. Okay. Casey Perry, come on. And good luck with the single. Now you're the business kid. Yeah. I've got a treat for you now. 
snow leopards. Ooh. In a moment, those baby snow leopards that I've been drooling over all day. But we've just got time for a quick.